Welcome on, ladies. It's me, Margie. Guess what's happened since you mother lovers last saw me last Christmas? <laughs> so first of all, I went on my holidays to Barcelona, which is in Catalonia, which I think's in Mykonos. I'm not really sure. And it was brilliant. The only thing is, I forgot to pack my nun robes. I know, I cannot believe that. It was so foolish of me. I had to go around borrowing people's stuff. I had to borrow a pair of shorts to use as nan robes. I can go out public like that. I went to the biggest church I've ever seen in my entire life and I didn't have my proper clothing on. I was blicking it. I had a pink t-shirt on. What the hell? What was I thinking, ladies? What was I think? I'm mad. I've actually gone mad, you know. Anyway, I filmed a music video. There were some lovely ladies in Catalonia there was, and they really, really helped me. Their names were probably on screen now, actually, but they might, you know, not let me do that. They might be here, actually. And after having it up, and it reached 100 views on the tube of you, I thought, bloody hell, I've got to get in on this, I have. So you know what I did? I released it on iTunes. That's right, if you go to iTunes, or Google Play Music, or Spotify, or even bloody Tidal, it's on there. It's on Tidal. I'm with Jay-Z now. It's one step away from Kanye, but it's Jay-Z, okay? It's it's just fantastic. So, I can see who has played it, and we're going to do that now. We were at 96 streams last week, let's give it a ref refresh. It's taking the time. I said, let's see if the streams have gone up. We were at 96, but we've only got two. We've had two in the past couple of days. In the past week, at, oh no, sorry. In the past week, we've had two streams. In the past month. Since the beginning of January, it's had seven streams. So maybe it wasn't the biggest success as I thought it was. It had one on the 1st of January. Jesus Christ. I've listened to it more than that and I had to make the bloody thing. I got 37 streams in one day. I mean, that's pretty good. It's tragic, it really is. Also, since my last episode, I actually got a proper phone this time. Last time I was using some HTC phone. I was a bit flat, but Sister Marge got an upgrade for those uh, YouTube ad revenue, which is taken away from me. I'll get on that later. <laughs> Anyway, after that, I did get a little bit carried away, I did. See, I had this album planned called Alter. See, it's a joke, because of, like, Alter, Church Alter. And it was going to release on the 1st of January. And the reason was that is because I needed to have enough tracks to make it an album, which is 8, eight but I think 10 is really the minimum. So I had a Christmas song and a New Year's song, Christmas Gime, featuring Young Felsey, check it out on SoundCloud, and a song called Old Gang Signs. But, um, unfortunately, um... It just wasn't ready. And because I didn't release it at New Year's, I couldn't have the Christmas songs. It wasn't right. It was like listening to just Michael Bublé in a month that isn't December. It's just wrong, you know. So we've had to take that down. We'll be working it. Steven, who you've seen in a minute, great cracking job. But uh, it is annoying because I have been working on it since February. The first song, Flat, I did in February. It's, um, oh, it's lush. It is. it is absolutely lush. You've got to listen to it. You've got uh, Barcelona's on it, obviously. Track four, track five. I made it on the way to Barcelona. Stephen was sending me some files, and I said, I want that song, I do. Speaking of February, from this February onwards, from February the 20th, the channel that hosts me, Llama Fluff, what a legend, is going to be demonetized. Dirty freaks. I mean, don't get a Japanese man in a rope and a twist, YouTube. Calm down. I swear. Although I won't now, because if I do get monetized again, I'll get demonetized for swearing. Absolute hecking fools. Anyway, unfortunately, I haven't had 4,000 hours watch time this year. Come on, keep up your game. You're supposed to be watching me. You're supposed to be fans. Jesus Christ. And I don't even have 1,000 subscribers. I've barely hit 200. This channel, before I did like weird my YouTube video, Minecraft and all that shit, it's been going on since 2011. Seven years. And you haven't hit 200 subscribers yet, Lama Fluff, you absolute freak. So please, ladies, do subscribe. It's to hit these magical, magical, mystical a thousand subscribers. I really, really could only use um one hope, really, and that is Yeezus. Yeezus is the only thing that could save me, okay?
please give me everybody wins a bit early or something. I don't know. Ah, what? You didn't see that, did you? Anyway, we're gonna cut to Steve and Madly. He's the producer of the album and a little bit crazy. Hope you enjoy the clip from the interview. Hello, Stephen. Hello, mate. How's it going? So, who are you? I am the sole producer of Sister Margie's Alter. It was due to release 1st of January 2018, but uh, she cancelled it. Bit of a shame, really, because it was the only thing to go in my portfolio. Now I've got to have that CV at fucking Woolworths, and it's not going to be. Woolworth like, closed down, mate. Well, apparently Woolworths is shut down. But yeah, I used to be a bit of a movie producer, but I kind of cancelled that. I wasn't into the whole Vimeo scene. I just I just don't like French people, really. That's Daily Motion, mate. Oh, that's Daily Motion? Yeah. Oh, crap, I've got to have a massive job by now. Oh, thanks for telling me, mate. God. Do you believe this? Anyway, but now I kind of focus more of a sound engineering kind of perspective, if that makes any sense. If you know what sound engineering is, I engineer the sound to make it sound proper good. And your Beats headphones, they're not really worth anything, but, you know. Yeah. So what does being a sound engineer entail, mate? Well, sometimes when I sleep, I just have these spurts in my dreams. I just spurt and I have these amazing ideas just spurt into my head. And it's really quite incredible, I think. And I just wake up and go, boom, snap. And I go onto the computer and map out all the beats. And that's how I make a chart-topping hit like Barcelona. What was your most recent spurt? That's a bit fucking <laughs> personal, mate, isn't it? <laughs> hey! <laughs> No, but um, it was this really hot video. It was set in a church, yeah. And there was a priestess, and she was a bit, bit slutty. And she bent over, and you could see everything. Jesus Christ. I didn't last half an hour. I, I stopped it after a couple of minutes. I felt so disgusted in myself. You need help, mate. I know, mate. You, you really do, though. Well, it's the end, then. What the heck was that? Jesus Christ. That was a bit of a shambles, wasn't it? Anyway, last year I congratulated the 26 likers of our page, Christian Means for Teens. Check out the link in bio. I'm not Jake Paul, but I'm going to say it. Link in bio, link in bio, please like it. Please, it's my only source of income now. But um, this year we reached 500 likers. That's 500, 512 more people reaching Jesus. Can you, Adam and Eve it? Even better news now. I'm on so many hacking streaming sites. You cannot escape me. I'm on everything. Literally, go search up in the old Google box of Bing. Sister Margie Barcelona. I am everywhere. I'm like Jake and Logan Paul. It's mental. Speaking of my musical talents, smash that mother-loving like button if you're woke AF. If you want to see a second episode of this series. I know, a second episode. Mental. And I will show you how I record my songs and episode 3 might even do how I do the videos. I know, right? So yes, make sure to like the video if you're woke AF. I already said that, but I'm going to reinstate it. Hit that subscribe button down below. And if you really, really, really love me, follow me on Twitter. But also, I think it's like a bell icon, like John Bell. You ding it, then it goes ding and it annoys you when I upload a video which as you know from me I don't do often like twice a year so what have you got to lose in it thanks for watching ladies Jesus we love you we all went to den and then I had to pay if you're messing with the stove then you better be paid you know why it take too much to touch from what I heard she got a baby by Buster my best friend said she got her beast by Usher I don't care what none of y'all say I still love her now I ain't saying she a gold digger